going through all the stages, uh, you know, there are certain, uh, you know, the variables which plays, you know, uh, you know, the positive or the negative role uh, to change the perception of consumer towards that particular brand. Like, uh, like for example, if I talk about the belief, uh, I want to purchase, uh, um, you know, um, washing machine, and uh, I someone suggests me to go for the semi-automatic, right? But uh, one 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 of my colleague who already have purchased the washing machines told me that you know there are uh, you know the benefits when you go for the fully automatic. But if you have uh, your own house, only then you purchase uh, this because the, the, but the fully automatic machine is directly connected with you know, the tank. The second thing is you cannot insert any clothes in between uh, the, the process. Uh, and the third one is the amount of you know the 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 powder which you will uh, infuse so it will keep inside the particular you know the basket so everything will be cleaned and come out during the washing process but once you compare the same with the semi automatic then you then you can make changes according to your your wishes whatever you want even you can just uh, put clothes uh, during the washing process whatever the amount you of uh, you know the detergent powder you want to infuse you can infuse no problem in that so uh, when you hear from all these so suddenly you know the your beliefs change right and you wanted to purchase uh, a fully automatic but because of the because of the 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 things because of the negative part told by your friends you you finally change your uh, decision process right uh, then, then second is motive uh, if i got motivated uh, from a certain things the, naturally i will go for that but during my search process might be i, I heard something negative about that and finally uh, my my motive towards uh, you know the purchasing that particular event you know the vanish so uh, so uh, the belief or the motive could also play an important role while making the process decision making process then your attitude right your 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 lifestyle then your intentions your evaluation criteria uh, you know the normative compliance basically is your the norms uh, you know the compiled by the society there are certain norms like in in publicly you cannot go for uh, smoking or for go for the consumption of wine so these are a part of your normative compliance so uh, what Minyard here uh, talked about that uh, each and every uh, you know the decision variables could uh, you know, create a positive or the negative impact on each and the subsequent stage of the decision making process right and in in all these uh, you know uh, all these in a sense uh, making a positive or the negative you know the feedback positive or negative you know the uh, in the form of satisfaction or dissatisfaction the external factors plays very really important role you know uh, there are cultural norms, then social class, family influence. Like some, if if any family, the mother is opinion leader, or a father is opinion leader, or it could be a sister, it could be the opinion leader, right? Unexpected circumstances could be like you are going to purchase, and suddenly you forget your wallet, you forget your card, you you don't have your, you forget your mobile phone. You wanted to make payment through, you know. The, the, the credit card the card is not available internet is not working right uh, suddenly the tower tower has gone off so anything could be the unexpected circumstances right which could you know uh, create a, a positive negative impact on your buying decision process so uh, finally uh, the, the this model uh, basically uh, talks about uh, the decision making process uh, and and the interrelationship among all the the stages uh, right and th there are certain factors which plays very important role in making changes in a positive or the negative way 
and it starts with the input input could be your marketing and non-marketing stimuli then it goes uh, towards the information processing which happens in the memory and uh, you know you, while making decisions there are certain variables uh, you know that could create a positive or negative impact and uh, we cannot ignore the external factors like cultural norms uh, social class then then anything could happen without your knowing then family influence and the reference group so uh, this is all about your uh, angle collagen uh, mini model thank you thank you very much thank you